very seductive because they come here and they see all this and they're like, you know, what have I been missing the whole time? And, you know, there's it it a big attraction factor and everyone wants their piece of it. All of a sudden, you know, a few parties got started here, and now everyone wants to join. And it's, it's, it's great because it's so rapid to see a collective of, you know, every part of the city trying to get involved. We specialize on emerging art, talent, world talent, global talent. Uh, I grew up in the art world really showing Chinese contemporary art. Uh, I was Ai Weiwei's earliest art dealer. Um, I've helped, I really helped bring Chinese contemporary art into the art market here in the United States. It's really strange because, you know, I'll tell people I'm from Miami and they can't believe it. So it's getting to the point where people don't even think that anyone's actually really from here. And why we bring it to Miami is Miami really is um, a fabulous hub of culture. Every December during Art Basel, so many art dealers, so many art fairs. Here we come to really show what we do best and make it sing and bring the really choice pieces to our clientele. You get to be around people you admire and you wouldn't normally meet and never really landed here before and now we're all of a sudden a global hotspot and everybody and their mothers right next door. So art comes in a lot of different uh, uh, images let's say. We do have art which is uh, photography, then we have people painting, and then there's also the cooking art. I wanted to try to have a little more understanding between the peoples of North Korea and the rest of the world. And I had met this young, fabulous South Korean pop artist named Mina Chung, aka Kim Il Sun. And uh, Mina uh, took on a persona of the essence of North Korea, the essence of the power of the woman. I probably can't live with myself if I can't feel like I made something every day. It's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a personal challenge, I guess, you know. It's, it's an obsession, it's probably like a disorder at the same time. Lee Hung Bo, you know, he's a bookmaker. Uh, by, he spent a, a long time in that industry. He went to art school for at least 12 years, longer than any other artist I know. Um, we want to show that the people of North Korea are just like you and me. They're normal human beings. They have love affairs. They, they, go, you know, they go shopping at the supermarket. Uh, and so from a grassroots idea, we want to show there's humanity there. And as a citizen of the United States, a citizen of the world, we want to create a dialogue. And so through art, we're creating that platform. Whether they're real estate executives or a painter, you know, everyone, everyone wants their, to offer their part, you know. We want to show and expose these artists to the collectors of the world, the people who appreciate aesthetic. Make sure you come to Art Basel to see all the art that people have come from all over the world, combined here, one week in Miami. Just enjoy the weather, enjoy the atmosphere, enjoy the parties, enjoy everything.